control Away the pieces that you gave Betray it away Often I'm stuck on my back How could you do this? We've been through this for a while Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, how are you today? We from the group of SIG will tell the story of Roro Jungrang and don't forget to watch Long time ago, there was a kingdom named Prambanana All the people of Brahmana live peacefully. But then, Brahmana kingdom was attacked and occupied by the Penging kingdom. Brahmana then was ruled by Bandung Bodawasa of Penging kingdom. He was a mean king. He also had great supernatural power. His soldiers were not only human, but also jeeps. Banan had a beautiful dog named Loro Jongra. Bandung Bondowoso fell in love with her and wanted to marry her. You are very beautiful. Will you be my queen? Asked Bandung Bondowoso. Loro Jongra was shocked. She didn't like Bandung Bondowoso because he was a mean person. She wanted to refuse. But she afraid that Bandung Bodowoso would be angry and angry the people of Pramana. Then she came up with a plan. If you want to marry me, you have to pull a thousand temple from me in just one night, said Loro Jangga. What? That impossible, said Bandung Bodowoso. But he did not give up. He consulted with his advisor. Your Majesty can ask the genies to help pulling the temple," said the advisor. So, Bonomono was so somewhat his entire genies soldier and commanded them to help him pull a thousand temple. The genius work in unbelievable speed. Meanwhile, Roro Jungra heard from her servant that the building of a thousand temples was almost finished. She was so worried, but again, she came up with a great idea. She asked all of her servants to help her. Please. Burning the straw and make some mice pounding the mortar. Quickly, said Roro Jongram. All the servants did what Roro Jongram ordered him. Burning the straw and pounding the mortar, making the genies think that the sun is going to rise. It's already done. We have to go, 
Said, the leader of the Jenis, to Bandung Bondowoso. All the Jenis immediately stopped their work and ran for cover from the sun. They didn't know that the light was from the fire that burning the sun, not from the sun. Bandung Bondowoso can stop the Jenis from leaving. He was angry. He knew Roy Jungram had just taken him. You cannot fool me, Roy Jungram. I already have 999 tumbles. I just need one more tumble. No, I will make you the 1000 tumble. He pointed his finger to Roro Jungram and said some mantras. Magically, Roro Jungram's body turned into stone. Until now, the tumble is still standing in Prambanan area, central Java. And the tumble is called Roro Jungram Temple. This is the story we can tell about the Rojo Grand Fairy Tales. Thank you for attention. See you.